10, a South Suburban mayor fighting for more than his political opponents on the ballot. A new lawsuit means the mayor of Markham could get booted from said ballot in April due to a felony conviction. CBS 2's Jermont Terry talked to him about his questionable past and his political future. Oh, he took a preliminary. Mayor Roger Akpawa finishes up a few meetings, but he has no plans to wrap up his time at Markham City Hall. Around town, there's clear support to keep him in office. We're getting them to live with a thought. A thought he believes highlights the city's progress. He touts the new Amazon facility opening this year and plans to bring in more business. We, we let people have, they're, they're going to take ownership of this. It belongs to them. We're just reminding them th uh, that it belongs to them. Yet a new lawsuit keeps reminding the mayor of his past. I'm probably a little bit past 1999. Akpawa is a convicted felon who served time for federal mail fraud. He ran and won office in 2017, but spent half his time fighting to get sworn in. Then Governor Bruce Rauner stepped in and restored his citizens' rights. Now Akpawa is fighting a lawsuit that claims Rauner's orders don't supersede a federal conviction. Are you worried that this reversal could happen and affect your next chance of remaining there? Not at all. Uh, I mean, uh, honestly, no. I, I mean, I believe that uh, the governor had a battery of attorneys to look at what he did before he gave a signature as he would with any document in the state of Illinois. And while the mayor says he's not concerned as to what's outlined in this 68-page lawsuit, legal experts say it does carry some merit and could decide if he remains in this seat. Um, I, I wouldn't be optimistic at this point in time if I were the mayor. CBS 2 legal analyst Irv Miller points Agpawa's rights were restored in Illinois only. There's nothing in former governor's order that, that says, okay, you're, it's okay that you become mayor because frankly only the president of the United States can pardon somebody for a federal crime. Agpawa's name remains on the federal clemency request. Who, who's to say what uh, this president or the next would do? Um, so I'm optimistic at any point, but do I need it to serve? No, I don't need it to serve. In Markham, Jermont Terry, CBS 2 News.